channel I do hope you're doing well your girl has got a cardi on today because it is blooming cold let me tell you that and it's even better because the coziness just makes for a better video because my lovelies we have uno bag does bag of Shein Shein I might have done a little order just before I went away um, primarily Halloween themed so it's probably coming to you really really late because Halloween is probably at the end of this week didn't really think this one through but there is some great little cozy essentials I know we're slowly coming out of autumn and going into winter but it is imperative that you are kept cozy and I have one thing here which I mean I am so blooming excited to wear let me tell you that so what I'm gonna do because they don't come in the big sheen bags anymore it literally just looks like someone's bundled it in there for me so I'm gonna get them all out I need to do my little thumbnail holding them all up and then let's get into it because there is a lot okay and some of the bits I want to wear now especially one of like the little nightwear bits let's get into it <laughs> my lovelies i don't think you can see the sheer amount i thought i'd done a little order um let me just try and can you see that and can you see all that we have, have quite a lot we have quite a lot so goodness gracious thank goodness i've got my phone here because i didn't think we was having this much let me just see i need to remember which one it is because I can't remember which one. I done two like basically at the same time. And that one that I done for the autumn come before. And then this one didn't come before. Let me have a look. Shein. Oh, now everything's going to. When was this done? Order delivered. Order has been shipped. Order has been shipped. Order confirmation. I know there is one right now. I've done that one. Done that one. Let's have a look. Is it this one? Yes, it is this one because the first item I was like, oh my goodness, I need them in my life. So, where are we going to begin? I think we just need to begin with whatever is on here. Let's have a look. Has stuff fallen? Oh no, I think stuff may have fallen. We're going to have to go with it. As I say, once again, Shein, everything in the bags. These are great. I didn't take any away on holiday with me this year, but... I have still kept them in my baby case because you never know when they're going to be handy. I pick everything up in a size 10 or medium depending on the size of it. And to this day, I haven't had anything bad from Shein. I mean, touch wood, everything is going to plan. Now, <gasps> you're going to see I'm getting very excited. I'm still in my holiday mode. But the thought of having, oh my goodness, it's not fully on there. Oh no, it's only giving me a few items. Right, when was the payment date? It's 100 and, right, let me have a look. Right, I found it. Found it, let's not panic. Right, now I just need to know which this is. Ombre ribbon it v-neck. Oh no, am I going to have to go and get my iPad? Argyle. I'm trying to learn like what all the prints are because I got a lot of printed stuff. Oh, hang on a minute. No. Bishop sleeve ribbed standing collar dress. This was £10.50. <gasps> I love it. I'm going to be an absolute pig's ear showing it to you. So, of course, I will intrude, intrude, include the try on clips. Guys, you know I said I want to try and get some more browns in my wardrobe. Brown dress, but look, it's like the poplin sleeves. Oh, I didn't even see that. They're cuffed with the jumper. So it comes down, down. It's not actually that long. I think we might be all right with this. This, oh my good, would look divine with a fedora hat, some chunky Chelsea boots, maybe some heeled ankle boots. Oh, I don't know. This is a size medium. Feels quite stretchy. We love to do the stretch test. The only thing is, oh, you might not be too see-through. You might be good. You might be good. £10.50, I think that's a bargain. Especially when you compare to, like, Primark. The prices are sometimes creeping up to, like, £12, £15, £18 for dresses at the moment. And <gasps> I need to get to Primark. I have had everyone saying to me, Sham, Primark has got its Christmas bits in. It's got its Christmas pyjamas. It's got its... I'm like, I can't. Once I get back from Newcastle, then I will be full Christmas mode. But for now, I need to enjoy the last little few bits of Halloween. 
go to Newcastle, and then when I come back, it's full shebang for Christmas, all right? Full shebang, my lovelies. I love that. Looking at it, first impressions, I mean, I'm doing a pig's ear holding it up to you, but yes, <gasps> very excited. You will tell that I get very excited by Shein parcels. Very excited. I'm trying to see if I can, I mean, I say work my way through the list. I have no idea what is in the bag. Let's have a look. What have we got? That's some type of receipt. Right, what is this? What are you? What have, have I bought fabric? Have I bought fabric? Oh my goodness. What is this? Oh my god, it's an apron. I'm thinking, what on earth have I bought? <laughs> A ghost and bat print apron. Oh, it was there. £2.75. Oh my god, that is a adorable you know what i'm actually filming tonight 24 hours eating halloween food i'm so gonna put this on i will still insert a try on cliff don't you worry about that my lovelies i'm gonna be loving life with this i know people may look at this and say it's tat two pounds 75 it's absolute tat but you know what this brings me so much joy so when we're doing at la 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 look i'm in so much joy i can't even speak when we do our 24 hours eating Christmas food. Christmas, Halloween, oh my God. I am so to do, my lovelies. I don't think I've grasped reality since I've been back. 24 hours eating Halloween food and when you spend Halloween with us, this is gonna be out. You might even see this on Mama G. I might have to get her in it because I think she's just gonna absolutely love it. £2.75. I would say, can I hang you? Oh my God, I'm hanging you on the camera right now and you're a fabulous dress for the camera stand. I mean, uh, two uses for one, eh? Oh, my God. This is a jumper. I'm sure it's a jumper. I'm sure. Is it a jumper? <gasps> yes, it's a jumper. Guys, you know, right, I love Shein hoodies. Shein hoodies for me, comfy and go-to. I cannot fault them enough. What have I ordered on some of these? You know when you go through and you see the um, descriptions and I think, Shannon, what on earth have you actually bought, girl? Um, we are going to see... Oh, okay, I might have bought another apron. Oopsie. I don't know what this is. <laughs> oh, that's great. Is it this? It's a jumper, ain't it? Oh, my God, that's huge. Is this a medium? Oh, it's fleece-lined. Did you notice there, my lovelies, in like 0.2 seconds, I went from, oh my God, it's huge, to, oh my God, it's fleece-lined. Like, my attention span is just absolutely out with the fairies. I am going to say, letter graphic thermal line sweat, 750. I just like this because, number one, I like black. It says Hello Pumpkin. And this is just going to be fab because, obviously, Halloween's going to be cold. And I know we are in the run-up to Halloween, so I need to be getting my Halloween pumpkin season on, okay? I can't be going to work in these boring t-shirts now. Yes, I am filming you directly after work. Trust me, I didn't look like this at work. Your girls put some slap on for you. But uh, I will be rocking this tomorrow. Do I rock this? Or, oh my God, imagine if I went in the bat apron. Can you just get a gist of how my mind runs 24-7? Just through that last, like, minute or so of me waffling on. That is how erratic my head is. £7.49, Hello Pumpkin. I'm going through my wardrobe in the new year, so I think there's going to be like a big decluttering episode with me because I need to go through. this stuff that I've had since I was in college. Now, I haven't been in college for over a decade, so I think I'm holding on to it. But, you know, it's just like... You might have them, they're like jumpers that are like your go-tos. If you don't know what to wear, you just chuck it on. Because you know it fits, you don't care how it looks, and it's just comfort. Comfort is key, okay? But part of me is thinking, you need to make a bit of room. And are you really going to wear them again? I mean, I wear them for work, but then I don't wear my nice stuff for work. So maybe if I get rid of like an old sweat, I can replace it with that sweat. That is the logic. That is the logic we are going for, okay? Whether it works or not is another question. Let me tell you that. Oh, there's two bits in here. What have we got in here? Oh, this is what I was thinking. What on earth have I ordered? I've ordered some cycling shorts. You're probably thinking, Shan, we're coming into one of the coldest winters and you're wearing cycling shorts. No, it's for under my dresses to stop me getting chub up. And these, oh, these feel good. These feel good. So I got a grey pair. And then there is also a black pair. And how much were you? 
$10.99 for two packs of a wide waistband cycling short. I don't think that's too bad. Oh, these are quite lurexy. Okay, so we've got like a grey marl fabric one. And then these are like Spanx material. Very shiny lurexy, like a hot pants style. I mean, oh, they've got a bit stretched to them. Oh, because yes, I still have tremendous chub rub. And I'm never going to lose it, unfortunately. So I will show you in the try-on clip because they're not going to ride up my bum too much. I'm not going to expose myself. Don't worry, my lovers. I'm going to keep my dignity. But, um, yes, I thought they're handy because even in the winter, if you have a nice long dress on and you don't want to wear tights, unfortunately, I don't have that option. If I don't wear tights, I need to wear shorts. This is another apron, I think. I bought two aprons. So this one's a bit more like a rustic vibe. I like this. But this was more expensive. So this, my lovelies, is... Where was you? I saw you earlier. A mushroom and pumpkin print apron. So this one was £4. But it does feel like the Rattani style. Oh, my God, I love that. <gasps> Guys, I love that. You can see what I mean by, like, the Rattani style. Where the other one was £2.75. It's kind of just like a white clean one this is like proper farmhouse rustic vibes you know what when i move out i'm gonna have to have like a hook on my door or somewhere for my aprons because i never wear them in the house you know me if you see me cooking videos never ever wear an apron but i used to love wearing an apron at school at college at work because when you took it off you felt that's it i've accomplished something it's all done and dusted this is so cute so blooming cute oh my goodness well actually now there's one each for me and mama g can I hang you on with the other one? There we go. I mean, the weight of it is not going to tip the camera forward. But, oh, I'm looking at two nice little aprons. See, stuff like this makes me happy. I am still a child. In my uh, ripe old age of 27, still a child. Oh, 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 Right. If you saw the autumnal sheen haul, you will know I picked this up in orange and absolutely fell in love. When I tell you I fell in love, I fell in love, okay? And, well, I hadn't even tried these on before I reordered it, but lucky I did because I wanted to reorder it, but now I don't need to. Let me just do a few more of the buttons up because these are gorgeous, okay? The colours, the style, fantastic. So... Do you remember this, my lovelies? So I picked it up in the mustard. Very autumnal. Very, very autumnal. I love it. It is a rib top. Slightly, I'm going to have to wear a white bra because it could potentially be see-through, this colour. But I love it because with the buttons, you can have it as low as you want or as high as you want. There's no uh, judgment here, let me tell you that. And I think this is called... No, I don't think you're that button up. Oh, you might be. Let me just, you know, we have to double check the uh, sayings because I don't want to tell you something. No, it is that one. This is a Shein button up rib knit tee. This is £10.50, which is quite pricey for a kind of finished top. But I think you pay because of the buttons and the styling. And this is the perfect top. You can wear away to work, have it all done up, and then undo a few buttons of a nighttime, jeans and a nice top vibe. Jeans and a nice top is the era I'm going into at the moment. I don't know what to wear. Jeans and a nice top or jeans and a jumper. That is right up my street. Oh, my God, you're so going to laugh at me. And this was actually the first thing that I put in the order. So, um, my love, this, this was £1.75, okay? And don't shout at me. You're going to think it's absolutely ridiculous, but I don't. Guys, I got a little pumpkin headband. £1.75. How cute. I should have done the thumbnail like this. Like, hey. Oh, my God. I'm such a child. I wish I'd have got one for Mama G. But when I got this, it actually said last one in stock. So it might be me and Mum will have to share this on Halloween. But, yeah. Oh, my God. Could I, I could imagine myself going into work with that on. That's the thing. I think I would... Definitely get the mixed hook out of me. But if you can't enjoy Halloween at Halloween, when can you? My lovelies, you're going to be seeing all of this in the Spend Halloween with us. Actually, Spend Halloween, you might see my hair transformation. That could be exciting, let me tell you that. Right, this 
this, this. This is what I meant when I said cozy, okay? Cozy central. Now, let me find you because I think you was about £10. Well, I can't find you on here. It would have been called Teddy. Teddy, Teddy, Teddy. You're not a dress. You're definitely not a dress. Have I bought... I bought more shorts. Oh, no, I've bought uh, sport leggings. Yes, there is gym wear. There is gym wear, let me tell you. Right, I'm going to say, because I cannot find this. Obviously, they've charged me for it. Because... I wouldn't have had it. I'm going to say this is about twelve fifty to thirteen pound on this one. And just you wait, just you wait. Oh my god! Right, we all know I love something cozy, don't I? Oh my god, it's huge. It's actually huge. So this is a medium. Oh, <gasps> guys! I would actually wear this out. I'm not even going to lie. I bought myself like a little play suit. But it was advertised as like a nightwear romper. So obviously if I had this as nightwear. Oh no, there's buttons. Is there buttons? Yeah. Are they just fake? Or are they were Oh no, they are buttons. So this was £12.50. £12.50. I saw it because I didn't think it was buttons. So you button it up. Now I'm not gonna lie, right? It's a little uh, chocolate brown teddy play suit. I would rock that with knee-high boots. People will never know that it's a loungewear set. People would never know. I think that's really stylish. Really stylish. Black top, Billy Eilish. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I love that. You could even wear that out and put like a blouse underneath. How classy would that look? Oh my God, love that. Love that. And I'll tell you what, right? I've got my um, sheet, my fluffy sheet still on, but... I'm not going to lie, I cannot wait to get my teddy bear fleece bedding back on. You know, like we had the autumnal one. I can't wear, can't wear, can't wait to get the one for winter on. I'm going to also try and find a teddy bear Christmas one because bills are going through the roof, so we need to keep ourselves warm. That was a very good thing. I saw a comment on one of my videos and they said, keep yourself warm, not the house. Smart thinking there, absolutely smart thinking. Right, what is this? I mean, I know I love colour. I know I love tartan. So if we need to find something that says tartan. Oh, it feels soft. It feels soft indeed. What are you? Oh, I think it's a skirt. I think I ordered myself another skirt. Um, why did I do this? Clearly, I like the skirt last month. It was a little bit short, I'm not going to lie. Plaid knot front asymmetrical hem skirt, £12.50. Okay, there's stretch to it. I like this. What I liked about this, now looking at it, it reminded me of kind of like, you know when you tie your shirt around your belly? Because where it's like off lengths, it's like you've just tied your skirt around your skirt. You've tied your shirt around you, you know? That does look quite short though still. Oopsie, oopsie, oopsie. I mean, you will see on the trial clip. I hope it's not too short to expose myself. It shouldn't be, though, because there's all different lengths. It should be all right, she says. We will see in the trial clip. But, yeah, skirts. Would I wear this with tights? Probably not. I'd probably rock it with, like, knee-high boots or, like, a nice, chunky ankle boot. Or Doc Martens. I'm, I mean, I'm loving this now. I'm living in the moment, let me tell you that. There's a lot of colour. <gasps> you know what this is this is what i was looking at when i saw leopard print these are you know me you know i cannot do a haul and not pick some of these up and that my lovelies is when i find it oh my goodness i had it earlier plunge no you're not a plunge leopard print wide waistband sports leggings 10.99 you know me, I cannot rave enough about the sportswear. I love the colour. Sold. I have the leopard print in the shorts, if you remember. I've got them in pink and baby blue. But when I saw the leggings in a teal, I thought, of course, we've got to give them a go. So the reason I love Shein um, gym wear is, you see this huge high waistband. 
super stretchy as well and on the back you've got a little bit of ruching on the bum you know because there's no harm in having a little bit of a pick me up oh i'm so excited to try these so excited if you said to me what would be one brand of gym wear that you would have forever it would be a very close call between Abel and Shein. Like, they are my top two. I don't mind a bit of Bowen T. Gymshark, I was a bit let down on because I found everything see-through. Maybe if I bought some of their material bits, I wouldn't have that opinion. But your girl's not paying £80 for a set, okay? Um, so we're going to leave that there. And Abel. Abel has my heart, okay? Abel is the place to go. Now, what is this? What have I bought? Have I bought, like, pink pink rubber what have i bought what is this oh my god now i know what this is now I know. i'm sitting here thinking i've ordered a bit of rubber i haven't this is a little accessory that i bought because you know if you've been following my um, fitness journey i've had a really bad shoulder and i don't know why it's just not working at all and i needed something to release the pain however I don't think, surely they've charged me for these because it wouldn't be in the bag, surely. I'm looking at like my random one piece bits, you know, and I can't, oh, there we are. One piece yoga stretch resistance band. This was £1.50. So the thing with this is I've got to try and stretch forward and all the way back for my shoulder mobility and some of these are really expensive in the shops and £1.50 I mean she in eat your heart out because that is just the place to go it is the place to go and it's also said on there that there's something else that should be out of the packet but I don't know where that's gone we're gonna have to find it but I got a new hat this is going to be worn next year when we go sunflower picking okay because I wish I'd have had it sooner not gonna lie i was devastated when i saw it and realized i'd missed the opportunity but what else could you do this i don't think this was too bad actually three pound 25 for a baseball hat oh it's even got a little head guard in there look i know people might think shan is tacky it's corny it's just got a little sunflower but it's got butterflies coming out of it and it's in this school just like acid wash gray Oh, no, I definitely need to do something about that. Look at that. It's so squashed. My head ain't that big. I mean, you get the vibe, don't you? You get the vibe. We're going to have to puff you out a bit, mate, because it's not a vibe at the moment. We need to cinch you in and make you a bit smaller. Small to fit my dainty head. Oh, and look at that. I've got hat here. You put one little hat on and that's it. Absolutely gone to town. Oh, we are. We've got some little bits here that are outside it. Right, this is what I mean about me random bits, okay? So, I mean, you couldn't get more random than this, could you? This is a one-piece hair removal brush for one pound. A lot of you had told me about this for my carpet when I said that the um, Hoover had problems sucking it up. You was like, get a hair removal brush. I thought, I don't want to invest in like a tenner on Amazon. What way does it go? There's two ends to it. You've got that style and then you've got that style. Which side is it? Because they both pick hair up, surely. Look at this. The thing that's like one pound, which is supposed to be like a hack, and I don't know how to work it. Oh, I'm sure I'll figure it out. I'm sure I'll figure it out. I'll be all right. What have I got here? Oh, my God, I got scrunchies, didn't I? Yes, I got scrunchies. You can tell that I am an absolute child, can't you? You can tell I'm an absolute child. Now, how many are you? Because I think you're a set. One, two, three, four, five. Oh my god, guys, five scrunchies. Five scrunchies. Are you kidding? Five scrunchies for one pound twenty-five. No, that's not right. Oh my goodness. So we've got one here. Oh my god. I'm gonna try and show you with little ghosts on. Can you see that one? We've got ghosts. We've got this one, which is like pumpkins and spiders. <gasps> Cute. This one, oh, this is like demonic pumpkins. And then we've got, I don't know what this is. It's just kind of like a black marble one. This is snazzy. 
And then the last one is cats. Cats in the house, you know? <gasps> oh! Oh my goodness. Sorry about that. Cannon died on me. <laughs> Clearly was not excited for my um scrunchies. And this again is probably not a necessity for everyone, but for a woman, it definitely is. Oh, hello. I've had someone uh, drilling doors above my head when I got in from work. Mama G politely told them at six o'clock to stop the noise because that is the rules of our council. And here we are at 25 to seven, still getting a few bangs here and there. Mm. I got this, my lovelies, for £1.50. You might think, Sharon, what is it? It looks like a little teddy bear bag. No, it's a little um, sanitary towel bag. So you can put your sanitary towels or your tampons in and away you go. This is probably not essential, but for me, I always, I always get a bit panicky if I have to carry them. And so for example, someone has to go in my bag. I'm like, oh, this is so cute. This is so cute. And it's gonna cheer me up when mother nature comes. Cause I can be like, I get to use my cute little bag. See, Shein has absolutely everything. Anything you can imagine, Shein has. Right, I know what this print is. So I think I know what this is. This is an Argyle print collared dress. <gasps> Again, I'm definitely trying to get browns in my wardrobe. Oh, this is giving me such twiggy cricket rugby style vibes guys size medium again i am looking at these mediums though and thinking that they look really big like i might have been able to get away with a small but it's kind of like this off peach i'd say it is brown but it kind of looks off peach it does look kind of see-through i'd probably have to have a nudie woody bra and undies on with these because i'm holding it up and like, i can see through to the wardrobe so maybe not the thickest, but what was you, 10.49? You could always wear it with like a pair of tights, a hat, a jacket over if you if it was see-through. Hopefully it's not, you'll see in the try on clip. But this seems a little bit longer, a little bit longer than the other dress. Oh, just got a thread hanging there, put that there. But again, yes, I'm trying to get some brands in. Have you noticed that? The browns are trying to come through. And then you couldn't get as far away from brown as possible if you saw this this was i think this was the most expensive thing that i had yeah this was 17.99 okay but this is something i am going to keep oh my god it's so soft this is something i'm going to keep forever and ever okay size medium so you know we all have our christmas jumpers did you know you can get halloween jumpers because I didn't until I saw this. Guys, look. It is a knitted orange sweater with bats on. Bats and pumpkin faces. I mean, just can you? Actually, can you? I could not believe when I saw this. And now it just makes me so excited because I want to look for like that Christmas jumpers. And I want to try and get me and Mum a matching Christmas jumper this year. But, oh! <gasps> Guys, I really hope this fits and looks nice. If it doesn't, it's going to be a very, very sad trial clip. Very, very sad. Let me tell you that indeed. But I know it's a lot, $17.99. But for themed jumpers, like Christmas jumpers, I know can be up to like £20, £25. So I think it's quite reasonable. But as I say, it's not for everyone's cup of tea. However, I just saw it and I was like, I actually need a Halloween jumper. So tomorrow is Thursday. So I could have my Hello Pumpkin sweat and then I could have that for Friday, like the piece de resistance at work. And then when I come back from Newcastle, I'll be like full on Christmas mode, okay? There's a lot of other colours that are screaming out to me. I mean, like, what is this? What have I ordered? What is... You know what? This is what happens. I get carried away and then I'm just like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, pyjamas. I remember this. Pyjamas, pyjamas, pyjamas totally the wrong style of vibe for pajamas because i'm gonna have to definitely have a dressing gown on with these okay these are halloween pumpkin and ghost print bow pajamas oh guys look i mean this would be fabulous i should have took these to the dominican republic i should have took a bit of halloween with me to there oh, these are so cute very stretchy love that and then the top is just a simple oh my god i love this 
You know what? I'd even wear that out. I would even wear that with high-waisted jeans coming up to Christmas. Christmas? Halloween. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god, I can't wait. I am so excited to try that on. Very different to the teddy bear lounge set, as I say. Obviously, I thought we was going to have a heat wave in October. I did when I was away, but I didn't bring that heat back with me, unfortunately. So, oh, I'm excited for that. What have we got here? Oh, we've got a bit of hands too. Hands tooth, hands tooth. Shannon Lee, what have you been ordering? You know me, I am partial to a bit of hands tooth. What is this? Shannon, what have you bought? Have you bought dungarees? Oh no, my lovelies. What have I done? Houndstooth crisscross back high waisted dungarees, £9.49. No, I haven't. Right, first off, just look at the size of them straps on me. I am petite. It comes down, down, down. Oh no, what have I done? I've done a huge mistake. Oh my god, and there's no way I can tighten them. I mean, it's very stretchy. Like, I feel like I could get in them, but... Aren't dungarees supposed to be, like, up here? These are literally going to be under the girls. I mean, clearly I was feeling adventurous and wanted to try some different styles. So we're going to go with it. Um, <laughs> Please don't laugh if it ends up going terribly wrong, but we're going to go with it, okay? What have I got? So I've got, for an autumnal Halloween haul, I have a lot of colour. What are these? Oh, I've got some shorts. These are more shorts. Textured honeycomb wide waistband shorts. £7.49. Okay. Very high waistband. Very thick waistband. I like that. We've got ruching on the bum. That's fabulous. And you know what, I just wanted a nice pair of black shorts because you know sometimes when it is like Mother Nature, I still want to get for Christmas a nice all black set. So I want like a sports bar crop top, the shorts, the leggings and a long sleeve top and a jacket if I can. Just so that when it is time of the month I still feel put together because I have black sets now but I'm still always worried when it's time of the month because you never want a little slip at the gym. And I thought these could be quite good. They don't look see-through. They actually seem quite good. I mean, oh, oh my goodness, I almost clicked my wrist doing that. They don't look like they've got a lot of stretch, but they have once you get in them. And then they like suck you in. Oh my goodness. Thriving. Oh, hello. Nice of you to make an appearance. Right, got a bit of burgundy. Oh my God, I can just tell from this texture. Guys, if you saw the last haul, you will know I picked up this green cross knit cropped jumper thing absolutely blooming loved it okay a sheen twist front waffle knit top to be exact six pound 49 oh <gasps> this is divine oh my god look at the color so i've got it in a green and now i've got it in like a crimson red burgundy this is the most gorgeous waffle jumper it's got cuff sleeves it's a nice little mesh design, but it's not see-through. I haven't had any problems with it. Is it a medium? Yes, it is a medium. It sits very nicely on the girls. It shows a bit of belly, which I don't mind with some high-waisted jeans. My belly is tanned at the moment, so your girl is getting a little flabby belly out, but six fifty. I wish I'd have got these and the mustard top in every single colour. So if that's still on the website, I think I'm going to do like a winter sheen haul. Um, best believe I'm going to be trying to pick them up because... You go, I just love them. Absolutely love them. What is this now? Have I bought more shorts? Oh, no, what is this? Oh, this is cute. This is very cute. Solid plunge neck contrast lace hem top, 750. Okay, this is very nice. So it's this gorgeous navy ribbed v-neck top. So you've got a good little plunge there. So it's going to show the girls off. But look at the little bit of lace detailing. Something like that with a high-waisted skirt I think would be so nice for a Christmas do. <gasps> oh, I really hope that looks nice. I really, really do. And again, they had this in loads of other colours, if I remember correctly. So... You know what I'm like, if I find something I like and it works, your girl gets it in every single colour, okay? She gets it in every single colour. This is very bright. 
the next bit it's probably not the um vibe we was going for but it's very bright and i believe this is the sheen ombre ribbed knit v-neck jumper this was 13.50 okay you're a little bit pricey oh but it's so soft <gasps> oh okay i take it back i take it back you are gorgeous oh my god guys look at this i'm gonna look like a squashy i'm actually gonna look like a human autumnal squashy look oh my yes yes color wave ombre you know i'm all here for ombre i want to look like a human squashy thank you looks a little bit short in the body though mama g wouldn't like this we all know she likes her jumpers long <gasps> oh i can't wait to pair this i would just put this on like with plain leggings or jeggings or jeans nothing too fancy with this because the statement piece needs to be the jumper <gasps> oh my god this is gorgeous i've actually done all right i think for an autumnal halloween haul there's still been quite a lot of color but i'm not mad at it i'm not mad at it we've got something else what is this now I haven't fit, I've ordered more trousers, haven't I? Yeah. Elastic waist tartan pants, eleven ninety nine. Now, if you saw last month, I got a pair of trousers and absolutely love them. They fit like a glove. Wow. Okay, look at the stretch on that. What was you? Eleven ninety nine. Look at that. They go down. Oh my god, and they're cuffed. Guys, they're not trousers, they're like joggers. Oh I could wear that with the Halloween crop top to try and be edgy, you know, and chuck on my big Chicago Bulls Primark jacket, which I've been living in, let me tell you. Not here for them cold mornings, my Chicago jacket has been loving life. Oh my God, I love these. They're a very lightweight jogger. They call them a trouser, but, well, tartan pants. Do they mean pants as joggers? Because it's got a cuff, which is fabulous. And I feel like on me, it's gonna give me like a balloon effect. But I'm here for it. I'm all here for it. Oh, the ones that I got last month were kind of like a structured design. They was very like tailored and fitted. Looked lovely and hands down very, very nice. But yeah. <gasps> and this is the piece de resistance to end on, which I'm so excited. I am so excited. What do they call this? This is... Da -da 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 -da. Where was you? Because I saw you earlier. Oh my goodness, I did see you. Where was you though? I think this is classed. Drink and pumpkin print thermal pullover, £7.50. So yes, I've got the black hello pumpkin one, but I had to get another one. This, oh my god, this just screams all them. This is a very unusual colour for me. But I'm here for it. Guys, look. Is there nothing more fitting? I need to wear this when me and my friend go for coffee on lunch. And I have my pumpkin spice latte. I need to wear this. I need to wear this. This is going to be the perfect coffee jumper outfit. Coffee jumper outfit? Well, it is. This and leggings. I'm good to go. I got it in a car key. Which, you know, there's not really a lot in my wardrobe. But again, I'm trying to branch out. Like with the brands. Car key. Bit of navy. And guys, for £7.50, right, you really cannot go wrong. Look at that. It's that thermal soft lining. So you are going to be warm and snug and toasty under this. You're not going to need a top on underneath, which sometimes with some jumpers, mum's like, put a vest top on. No, you're not going to need it with this. Oh, my God. I'm in heaven. I think I've ended on a banger. Ended on a banger. And let me tell you, my lovelies, I've now got to go and try all this on. So shall we round up this video? And then you will already know how this is. But I need to try them on. So that is our Shein Halloween edition. Halloween, still autumn. I couldn't have two called Shein autumn hauls because then that would look a little bit excessive. So I thought if I do an autumn and a Halloween one, we're good to go. Like I might do a winter and a Christmas Shein haul. If you would like me to do that, please let me know down below. Or if you think Shan, don't bother, let me know. If there's any places, though, that you think are really coming into their own for the fashion for winter, do let me know down below. As I say, I've got a few spaces for hauls that I'm not quite sure which shops I want to fill them up with because there's going to be a lot of content, okay? A lot of content. Your girl's going to be doing all the legwork, showing you all the best bits and bobs and bargains about. And I'm so boom excited. I now need to try all these on, which is going to be the mammoth task, but hey-ho! 
We've got a late dinner tonight. It's all m and Halloween food. Today is looking good, okay? But my lovelies, if you did enjoy the video, you know what to do. Hit that thumbs up and subscribe down below. Leave me a comment. What was your favourite item? Have you bought anything from Shein? Have you been on Shein Christmas shop? Is it worth the hype? Because I've heard quite good things about it. But for now, your girl just needs to still soak in the autumn and Halloween goodness, all right? Take care, stay safe as always, and I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video. And you're probably sick of my face right now. You've had hours and hours with me on holiday and back-to-back -back uploads. If you're sick of me, just tell me, okay? But I hope you're not sick of me because it keeps me busy and it keeps me sane. Sanity is everything in this world nowadays, and this is my sane place. This is what keeps me sane. But anyway, Shane, you need to go and try these on and let everyone get on with our day. Bye, guys!